generations of ages. I mean, Christ is risen from the dead, trampling down death by death, and to those in the tombs bestowing life. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, Ages, Amen. O Holy Trinity, have mercy on us, Lord, be merciful towards sin. Master, forgive our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for your name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord's Prayer all together. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, and we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and unto the ages of the ages. Amen. With the spirits of the righteous made perfect, Savior to the soul of your servants, preserving them for a life of blessedness that is with you, O lover of mankind. In your eternal peace, O Lord, where all your saints are reposing, give rest to your departed servants, O Lord, our immortal. Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. You are our God who descended into Hades. And ended the sufferings of those in prison there. Give rest, O Savior, to the soul of souls of your servants. Look now and forever into the ages of ages. Amen. O only pure and spotless virgin, who ineffably gave birth to God, intercede for mercy and forgiveness of the souls of your servants. Yeah. Yeah, my wife works with pups. You know, directly at this thing. She has an ASA. I'd like to get his name back. Yeah. He's right here. Let me know. Father, this is uh, Jeff from Hey, you probably invited him. Who's up? Okay. Alright, Mark. So, you know, here we're, we're here today for this convoy that's going to really celebrate uh, uh, veterans and the work that they've done uh, for not just Dutchess County, but the entire country. Uh, how do you feel today? Yeah, listen, th this remains America's most uh, solemn holiday. It's a, it's a moment that we recognize, regardless of circumstances, men and women for generations who not only gave up their lives in service to the country, but gave up living. Uh, and no matter uh, what experience we may have today, it's incumbent upon us to find some way uh, to pay our respects and to extend our gratitude, not only to those uh, obviously recognized today, but to give thanks to those who carry on with that loss. Why was it so important for this convoy to move forward today? Under the circumstances, uh, we needed to find a way to uh, bring uh, the uh, the importance of this holiday to as many communities as we can. The fact that we may not be able to gather together in a large group doesn't mean we uh, can't take the message to communities and front porches all across Dutchess County. What Mark Coviello and the Division of Veteran Ser Services has done with uh, a number of volunteers is taken the importance of this holiday uh, and our uh, requirement uh, to give thanks and, and bring it to uh, main streets and front porches all throughout Dutchess.
So with the excitement, you know, going right through the county, what is the, the message that you want the residents to be left with after this is done? No matter the challenge we face today, and we're all uh, social distancing for a reason, these men and women uh, in this, on this holiday deserve us to pause and give thanks. They not only gave their lives, but they gave up living. They gave up the experiences uh, to raise families and to celebrate holidays. And uh, as a country, uh, this is uh, so critically important uh, holiday. Uh, we can't forget it, uh, we can't ignore it, and we can't, uh, I think, um, ignore the, the principles for, for which they died. And today, uh, we give thanks. Awesome, thanks so much. You bet.